What's up guys, welcome to another Domination Commentary, this time on Invasion. And since YouTube really does consider the whole thumbs up, thumbs down thing a rating system, I guess I'll just continue on with my quote, or my sort of catchphrase to some people out there. Uh, please don't forget to rate the video, whatever you feel it deserves, as it does help my channel grow bigger and bigger. It only takes a couple of seconds of your time. Yeah, I guess I guess that kind of does fit in. So yeah, don't forget to give it a thumb. Some people are like, oh, why don't you say finger my video? I was thinking, please don't forget to finger my video, whatever you feel deserves, as it does help my videos come faster and faster. But that's a little bit too explicit for all the uh, the children that watch my video. So I could just imagine right now somebody's like, hey man, there are children watching this, or some shit like that. I'm not sure, but anyways, I am pretty much bummed out right now, tired. I'm kind of thinking whether I should stay up. Uh, so that way I could fall asleep tonight early and get up for school in the morning or I should just take a nap and I'm Really on the side of taking a, a nap right now because right now it's 605 in the morning and I have still not gone to sleep That is fucking awesome. I do that a lot and also I have a I have to write a paper tomorrow and a whole bunch of work Because you all know I'm a procrastinator man. I always wait till the last minute for everything I waited till the last minute to record this commentary. I had all week to record this one commentary. And I was like, you know, I'll record it one night of the week and then I'll render it and I'll upload it Sunday because I did take a week off from YouTube. For those of you who did not know, if you're wondering where the hell have I been, I took a nice week off. Um, so that was pretty nice. Uh, didn't really pay attention to my YouTube much or make any videos much. Uh, I did make one dual commentary that will be uploading soon my first dual commentary yeah I'm pretty much like a virgin with dual commentaries so that was my first one uh, let me know how it went we didn't talk about a lot of random shit we kind of talked about all the flaws of modern warfare 2 and it's not just a video of saying oh god terrible you know just terrible <laughs> something like that it's just we're trying to discuss in the video um the negatives about modern warfare 2 and that's that video would be that so i'll upload that probably tomorrow uh, right now it's Sunday and I'm gonna be uploading this commentary on Sunday so anyways um for all of those out there who get are getting sick and tired of us youtubers complaining about Modern Warfare 2 please remember that we are trying to help the community in general the gaming community that is because without our complaints our voices won't be heard and if anymore won't do shit about it even though they're most likely not gonna do shit about it anyways I think of it like this. Here goes uh, another one of uh, the end's great analogies. <laughs> a lot of people say I have good analogies. I don't know why. You know, I could I compare one thing to the other and I make an analogy on it. So I think of it like this. We are kind of like those people who stand outside the White House with those signs that says, "Stop war, bring peace." You know, but they're not gonna listen to us anyways. It's not like the White House is gonna say, "Hey." See those guys out there? They're saying stop war. So we're gonna stop war. We're just gonna we're gonna pull all our troops out. We're gonna come home and we're gonna say hooray for peace. Even though that wouldn't even work, because once we come home, the terrorists are gonna be like, they leave. You know, they're gonna jump up and down like a parade and shit. And then they're gonna realize that America just came in, shot their shit up because of course they blew us up. America came in, shot their shit up, and they're gonna try to retaliate. So that won't work, by the way. I'm not trying to get all uh, political here. I just want to point that out. I don't know why I just kind of drifted off topic But yeah, we're kind of like the people outside the White House saying stop war bring peace and the people inside the White House They're not gonna just you know Listen to us and stop the war so hopefully infinity ward will be the type of people that will actually listen to the protesters But I highly doubt it Me personally, I, th I think that they just took their money and they ran Fucking pussies Oh god. But um yeah, so just re keep that in mind when you're when you're about to like unsub to a YouTuber like we you know I, I love the way some people they're like, "Oh, stop talking about Modern Warfare 2's flaws or I'm going to unsub." You know, we appreciate you guys subscribing to us, but if you're going to try to use that against us, you can go to hell with that because that's that's just ridiculous, you know. It's not like we're sitting here counting all of our subscribers and like, oh my god, I just lost one, slipped my wrist, you know? We're not like that. Well, at least I'm not like that, and I know a lot of other YouTubers aren't like that. Some people 
might might be like that. So you might want to be careful with who you unsub to because you may be accessory to uh, assisting suicide. <laughs> so <laughs> you want to you want to keep that in mind. All right. So um. Anyways, uh, shit. I was gonna say something. Oh. Speaking of war and this whole, I don't know how I got, oh yeah, I was talking about the protesters of war. I'm sorry if I seem kind of, uh, off, off of, you know, shit, what was I gonna say? Off, um, just off beat tonight, you know, it's 6 a.m., like I've said before, and when I am tired, it's kind of like when I'm drunk, I do stupid shit that I never meant to do, and, um, hopefully one day I just won't wake up married, and two weeks later, my... my Whoever I fell asleep with says that they're having a kid. That that'll be fucked up, man. Uh, at that point, I'll really think, uh, contemplate suicide. <laughs> no, I don't think I would do that. But don't you guys love the randomness? But anyways, oh shit. All right, with war, and I was talking about war with these guys. You know, protesting war. Speaking of war, I'm gonna be joining the United States Marine Corps uh, on June 12, 2012. So that is in 792 days. Yes, I am counting because that is a big day, you know, signing up for the Marine Corps, knowing that what you just signed up for and where they're going to ship you, there's a great possibility that you will not be coming back. Well, I want to say great possibility. I'm just saying, you know, possibility that I don't even think I'm saying possibility. Uh, I think I am. I, I thought I said it wrong. But anyways, there's a great possibility that you will not make it home. And there's a possibility that you will be coming home in a nice fancy little box. So you always want to keep that in mind. But, you know, it's a sacrifice that you have to make. And for those of you thinking, oh, you're just going to war because you play video games. Dude, you play too much video games. I hope you go out there and I hope you see the truth. I know I'm not going to go out there. Uh, I'm not going to go out there. I'm not going to look at my fellow Marine, see that he's holding an M16 and be like, oh, you noob. I'm not going to do that. I'm not gonna go out there thinking I'm gonna spawn up. Some some dude actually told me that once. I remember I was talking about this in my other commentary a long time ago. But I just want to uh, update you guys every now and then because I know I know I do get a lot of new subscribers and 90% of people who just subscribe to me probably I'm not sure. I'm you know I just pulled that number right out of my asshole somewhere from the clear blue sky. But I'll just say the the majority of people who just subscribe to a channel don't go through the whole channel looking through every video, you know, so they might not know that I'm joining the Marines. So, on June 12, 2012, I'll sign up. Whenever they ship me out, I'll, I'll post a video at that time, uh, giving you guys the info about when the commentaries are going to be stopping for a short time. And when I return from the war, if I return, because, you know... Uh, I will continue making dual commentaries, and if I actually enjoy being out there as like a lot, and I, you know, I really don't feel homesick at all or miss anybody that I have back home, and you know, I don't know if my relationship with my current girlfriend is gonna last till I join the Marines, because you know, nothing is ever certain. But if it does, then that might be a reason to drag me home. So. When I do return home, whenever it is from the military, I like to think positive and say I'm going to return home. But the reality is, if I return home, I will continue making commentaries, of course. And by then, you never know, Modern Warfare 4 might be out. And this time, it might include noob tubes that just keep on shooting, you know, like a fucking uh, automatic shotgun. Just like, choo, 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 you know, that would be awesome, dude. <laughs> no, it wouldn't. There'll be imagine that you start a you start a game like search and destroy and you look up in the sky You guys ever seen the movie 300 the scene where uh, uh Spoiler alert where the scene where the guy who plays the main character I forgot the damn guy's name, but he looks up in the sky and all those arrows are coming Imagine if those were noob tubes and you're playing search and destroy That's fucked up man. You're it's over So that would be what automatic noob tubes would be like and I know this game is gonna end soon so, um, yeah, that's pretty much that. I don't think uh, Infinity War would be too stupid to come up with that automatic noob tubes, but you never know. Like, I, as I always, uh, oh, oh, that was a big mess up right there. Anyways, as I always like to say, Infinity War did wear helmets to grade school. So, you know, cut them some slack, guys. You know, they, they really did not make uh, a grade A game, but it is pretty good. Well, 
not really. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. Much more to come. Remember to check out the links in the description box. Peace. That was fast.